Yo, what is up everybody? It's your boy Audacity. Hope you're having a fantastic day so far. But today we're taking a visit back to Modern Warfare 2019 and 2022. So like I did for uh, BO4 in 2022, we're basically doing the same thing where get into a game, talk about it, see if I can slate it up a little bit, get a kind of a high killstreak game going, and just talk about what this game was for me back when I played in my prime, see how it is now. But anyways, let's hop right into the gameplay. I can't say I've honestly played this map myself. Uh, honestly, they've added some new maps since I last played, which is cool. Wait, I don't know. Maybe I'm looking at it wrong and I've actually played this, but who knows. Good old quality H2. Gotta get hydrated before tonight's stream. Gonna be streaming some Apex with Connor and possibly Zach. I don't know if we'll do it in time before Zach gets off. Dylan, I'm guessing, is going to join. Alright. Uh, it's kind of looks familiar. My guess people are going to come from my left. Nope, alright. Never mind, he's in the corner right there. Yeah, this map is... Dude got lasered. Kind of hard to go for a high kill game when I don't know the map, but... We'll play it out and see. God bless it. Dang, he's right there. That gun that he's using, that was an OP weapon back in the, uh, but when I was playing it. I think it still is. Well, I keep saying, like, back in the day, like, it's been a few years, but no, it was not long ago. But that gun when it first came out, I remember if you play, like, Dom, or not Domination, uh, Search and Destroy, the way you wind up the gun right after spawn, you could just straight shoot through, uh, straight through the walls and just outgun everyone. Like, you could, like, sh across the map, wall bang, um, off spawn and, uh, Search and destroy. Nope. Not today. Trying to listen. Alright, there we go. Got a sound horrible in this game. See, like, footsteps aren't that loud in this. Like, yeah, like, yeah, I got dead silence on. It helps with it, but just make it a perk and, like, you wouldn't have to worry about this. Alright, I'm not, I'm not gonna push too far out. There we go. I got an assist in that, really. God bless it. Was there an enemy behind me, or where was he at here? No, it was just that guy that got me. Right. It sounded like there was a guy behind me. Nope. Whoa, 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 whoa. If I say, if I die here, it's on me. Oh my gosh, that guy right there. Respect if you're going for like dark matter or like not dark matter, uh, Damascus in this game, but if not, why? That's my one question. Why? I feel like the rooftop would be the. Where'd he go? Like, okay, right there, I very. I, I, you can clearly hear his uh, footsteps. Clearly, but that's beside the point. a picture there it looked like for a second. I don't know how I missed that guy. I don't know how I missed him. But like I said, mainly when I played this game, I played Search and Destroy and uh, Shoot House, which I was very surprised when there was uh, no Shoot House uh, playlist. This seems like 
that that thing's uh, that post has always been in the game since when I played. Shoot house and like uh shipment. Like always. Hello shotgun. But um I was very surprised with that, which I don't know. It just feels a little different because the playlist they had now was uh some map in Rust. Wow, well, okay, there we go. Uh, okay. And I don't know how I feel on that. I feel like you always gotta have like playlists like that, like that was an enemy? Shit. But um, they should definitely should have, have always have that playlist in here, in my opinion. No, thank you. Oh, the seven two five. I miss that shotgun. No, not really. Oh, uh, it's been such a long time since I've missed playing with shotguns. How I miss them. Uh, two shotguns and then stun like that. But one thing I hate is that like once you don't have dead, dead silence, it's very slow. Like you move like very slow. It seems. See, like, the shotgun stuff right here, I remember, is vividly why I stopped playing this game. Vividly. There you go, nice two, two old long shots there. Oh, two night. Dang, I oh, there's two of them there. I would have died regardless. I don't know. That it seemed like people camp so much in this game. I don't know what it is. Like, I, I'd always find people with, like, claymores on buildings, camping with shotguns and stuff. Like, I don't know why people got to play like that. Like, what is fun about playing like that, in my opinion? Like, what makes that so fun? To camp in a building the entire time. Only get a few kills. Like, in a game like this, you'd only get, like, what, 8 to 10 kills? But you you go on a streak, yeah, but it's just not fun like that. Honestly, I think what kept me so interested in this game was Gunfight when it first came out. I was fascinated with that. Like, I remember... At one point, I was on, like, th a thousandth in the world for uh, wins in gunfight, I think. I would just play gunfight constantly. I think my rec uh, I went on, like, a streak of, like, 30 or something like that. But it was a lot of fun. Like, gunfight was the game that really interested me in this, was just doing 2v2s. I, I saw that they are bringing that back, so maybe I'll have to do a little bit of uh, playing gunfight again, see how that goes. Maybe do a little series of... Like, when they do tournaments, that was really fun right there. Like, doing tournaments to get those rewards. I had a lot of fun with that. But, uh, it seemed that, like, further and further on in the game, it just wasn't as fun. Like, let's see. Like, I like it how, like, uh, they added, um, like, camo-wise. Alright, hold on. I gotta, I gotta mute this. Nope, nope, nope. I don't wanna hear it. I don't wanna listen to your conversation. I think it was cool that they added, um obsidian in this wherever it's at so i just gotta actually go right here like i think it's awesome that they added obsidian in this like it's a very cool camo but like holy shit like they should have added that way sooner than what they did like within the i'm pretty i forget if they added it later it was like towards the end or if they, i want to remember if it was a year after but if i added it right at the uh like three months into the game oh my gosh i would actually have obsidian on the guns but 
I don't know. And I'm not going to be like FaZe Javid. I'm just going to grind out and uh, get every single camo obsidian. Like, screw that. Like, all power to Jeb for doing that. Like, I'm get, I'm, from what I've heard, they're going to probably do something similar like that in this game. And if they, like, add it early on, I'll, I might work for that. I don't know. I have some guns I get obsidian, but it's not going to be like Jeb, where I have every gun. Okay, what was that? I focused up there and I actually did something. That's cool. They're gonna get the point, probably. Why not? Dude didn't know what hit him there. Dude didn't know what hit him. Definitely gonna be watching spawns here. We definitely gonna have to go for it. All right, get in here. Let's go for it. Let's go for it. Let's get it. Why? Why? Oh my gosh, I was popping off there. Wow, that's what I like to see. Oh, shit. Oh, come on, get me in there. Sure, take both my kills. Dang, we we popping off there. That's why I'm doing a 10v10. No, 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 no. Check this. I have EOD on. Son of a biscuit. I don't like the sound of all these shots. I'm way too. Yeah, close. Son of a. Uh, happy thoughts. Happy thoughts. Let's see over there. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. I... Sniper glint. Uh-uh. Where'd they come from? Where'd they come from? They come my left there. I'm not gonna want to push that. Where's they coming from? Dang! Guy from across the map got me. Uh, good try. Good try, though. 
Dude, save for that VTOL. Save for that VTOL. He's gotta get... Dude, if he can get that v VTOL, we are set. No, up oh, he died. That didn't last long. That didn't last long for him. Well, let me know down below what you honestly thought of this game. Good, bad. Was alright. Uh, had too many, like, OP weapons. Had too many, like, bugs. Whatever it was. I thought it wasn't bad in the beginning, but I couldn't play with it towards the end. Dang it. They're gonna... Come on, teammates. There's only, like... Oh, there's half at the lobby. Shit. Why would you use that now? Did I actually just let that happen to me? I did. Can you guys not get off? Freaking point? Like, holy shit. That dude survived the entire thing. Like, I have ghost. Okay, I do. Right. I need to start picking off guys just from sides. Huh? Run this way. That's not good. That's that's gonna be a fun death right there. That's gonna be a fun death. Got two of them. Come on, teammates, gotta get in there. Gotta get in there. Two hundos. Two hundos at max. Come on, teammates. They're not. He's contesting it. He's contesting it, but we got. Ah, no! What was my team doing? Holy shit! Nobody had over 20 kills on my team. That would explain it. But no, the, I feel like this wasn't a bad game. It was a step sort of in the wrong direction in terms of... Uh, let's see, skill-based matchmaking was really introduced into this. You couldn't stay in the same lobby because of it. And they said that they... It was a bug at the beginning, never got fixed, and now that's a regular thing now is skill-based matchmaking, which promotes basically uh, players either sweat their balls off or suck it for a few games so they get into a shitty lobby with some shitty people and then just go off like that. I don't know. I'm really hoping they fix that for Modern Warfare 2. But this also wasn't a bad game. It brought some of my one of my favorite game modes, I think, which is Gunfight into it. Search and Destroy was amazing uh, playing with friends. Getting a six stack, a six stack of for search and destroy was amazing. Had a lot of fun uh, memories in that of this game. Infected was pretty decent on this map. I really hated ground war. Ground war was just insane. You just died from every angle on that. But overall, like this did bring war zone, so it's not too bad of a cod. It's not one of my favorites. It's not one of my like right at the bottom, like scraping in, like with like infinite warfare in terms of multiplayer. But it's it's not a bad cod. I, I I'd still come I'm, come back and play it, but it's just camping. Camping and shotguns for me, just ruin it. But anyways, like I said, let me know what you think about this game down below. Also, let me know how excited you are for us being in less than 30 days for uh, Modern Warfare 2 to come out, if you're excited for that. And then I will also be maybe talking about Advanced Warfare 2, since that is maybe supposedly the next COD for, what, 2025 or whatever is when it comes out. But anyways, hope you have a good rest of your day, night, or evening, whenever you're watching this. Peace out, everyone.